Glenn Parker High Vibration Foundation. You are watching Glenn TV. Thank you very much for joining me. I wanted to report in and talk a little bit about this third to fifth density transition about becoming more lighter and in every aspect of your life and just some personal experiences. So the last couple of weeks, I have not been feeling very well, particularly on days that I have a larger onset of unconditional love. And I've been having epic, 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 epic dreams that seem to go on for very, 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 very long periods of time. Some of which seem to be pillow reality existences. Just lots of things going on. I don't come back with a significant concept of any one of them but they all seem to be filled with a lot of excitement a lot of detail and they are so much like this reality they are so much more vivid than I remember dreams being as of before now I've been using and I should have had some of this I might go in the garage and grab like one of the empty bottles but the glutathione has been exceptionally helpful which has immunogens in it aminoglobulins and all the precursors needed for your own liver to make glutathione and that seems to really help with vibration as well and keeping a stable immune system so i'd say the last couple of weeks on and off however i've been able to be in a state of neutrality and non-judgment and I notice when I do that and I hold that for any length of time that I can almost at will now regenerate this feeling of unconditional love that I've been having the last couple years it just is a natural onset and when I find I'm get upset at someone or maybe a little frustrated you know my mom's coming up on 72 and she can, you know, sometimes need just an extra bit of patience for her to catch up with what's going on. Um, if for some reason I do get a little frustrated, it is painful. Or if, you know, somebody's doing something uh, in the real world, if I'm getting shopping, maybe they cut in front of me if I'm a little pensive or it actually hurts. Those feelings and emotions are painful in comparison to this idea of unconditional love and neutrality in this fifth dimensional type of idea of the all or the one and the one is the all. So I just wanted to report that and I'm having to eat really, 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 really well. I eat, you know, some things that are off my diet that maybe has like a little chocolate and the chocolate generally has sugar and stuff in it so I just can't have any of that. I can't drink, I can't smoke any marijuana whatsoever, so no pot. It just kicks my ass and is a lower vibration than what I'm feeling like right now. And I think that's all the news that's really fit to print at this point in time. Um, now that I've been less resistant as far as everything, unconditional love comes in and a lot more money comes in. I, in, in like one day I had like all this little bits of money come in and I'm like, wow, there's money in my account. I like that. More of that, please. So you are a differentiation in frequency and the more that you line up with the frequency of your joy and what is fun to you and put aside those frustrations in any number of ways you can do so and put aside those prejudgments because usually you're judging something from an, an, another simultaneous lifetime that is unresolved and that lifetime is looking for that forgiveness as much as that other person that may be needing forgiveness from you in this lifetime and keep in mind that could be the same person this other person that you're giving forgiveness to that might not be a family member, there be somebody you bump into off of the street from the seventh density, the oversoul level. 
this person could be another multiple simultaneous lifetime that you're having. So there's all these things going on concurrently. You are giving forgiveness for something that may be happening that's not this other person, but you have done in another lifetime. And this is why this person is showing up because this other lifetime, this other instance wants this forgiveness and is looking to have resolution so that you can consolidate yourself as a multidimensional being in fifth dimension. Ta -da! And that's what I wanted to share today. So there's all these things going on. Be easy on yourself. Drink lots and lots and lots of water. Yes, you're going to have to pee all the time, but it's good for you need to be hydrated. Now, don't go too, too overboard because you can drink too much water, but, you know, like eight ounces an hour isn't really a bad day in a 10 hour day. You know, that's a good 80 ounces. At least half your body weight in ounces is a really good barometer. And if you're in more like, like here in the hotter environments, like a hundred something today, and uh, you need extra, it's because it's hot and it's dry. Like when I lived in the beach city, you didn't quite need as much water. You know, you go down by the beach or you're by the beach and you have a lot of moisture and humidity coming in. So that is what is what's wanting to share. I have a lot of muscle weakness and a lot of tiredness, a lot of unconditional love in the last couple of weeks, but not just not feeling it, not quite feeling myself. Not quite feeling in my body and everything I've, I've listened to says that this feels like the, the, the transition into fifth dimension and the ascension symptoms very much feels like dying. So, uh, yeah, you know, so it, it's like, ah, you know, I don't, I don't like it. It feels funny. <laughs> it doesn't feel quite right. But um, the glutathione definitely, 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 definitely helps. I've actually sent some. Um, to someone else uh, halfway around the world that was having some problems <clears throat> and uh, it has helped them as well. So I think just as a overall health product is one of the better ones that I've come across as far as being a broad spectrum type of item where accelerating glutathione levels can fix all kinds of crazy things going on in the body and help the ascension process. Yay. Thank you very much for joining me again, Glenn Parker High Vibration Foundation. Sending the intent to send you as much of this unconditional love that I've been feeling that you feel is appropriate for you. Thank you for watching Glenn TV, coaching life, business, and spiritual. Also retreats, boys and girls. Don't forget retreats down below in the description. There are tons of things going on. Find the link that speaks to your heart. Well, it's a little farther down, but speaks to your heart rather than your head, and you'll find the information you wanted in this lifetime. And if you do like this video, please do like, subscribe, and share. And of course, comment and ask questions. I love interaction. Sometimes you see people exchanging ideas and whatnot on some of these posts. So that's um, definitely what the inspiration is for doing this, is disseminating information in my own way, in my own time, that I felt would be useful for others. Thank you very much and have a fantastic day.